Recently, the new Xbox full screen experience for Windows handhelds, debuting on the ROG Xbox Alloy X, became available through Windows Insider Builds, and this means we can now install it on our own Windows handheld devices and try it out for ourselves. And in this video, I'll be guiding us quickly on how to set it up and access the software, and for a deeper dive, I've linked additional material from creators like The Forks, ETA Prime, and others in the description, which I highly recommend viewing to see whether installing the Xbox full screen experience is right for you. Of course, this is an in-development build, and there's a lot of discussion going on around how this may improve and features we'd like to see in the future. So before we get started, please give this video a like, subscribe to the channel, leave a comment, and share this video with others. From our Windows desktop, we want to go to our Start menu, and then we want to choose Settings. From here, we want to go to Windows Update, and we want to go to the Windows Insider program. From here, we want to go to Open Diagnostics and Feedback, and we want to toggle on Send Optional Diagnostic Data. Let's go back. We want to choose Get Started, and link an account, and choose our Microsoft account. Choose Continue, Press continue on the first box, and then we want to make sure we choose the fourth option, release preview. And it's very important that we choose this. We want to choose continue, and then restart now. Go back to Windows Update, and just check for updates, and make sure that you're all updated. Let's check the gaming tab, and we'll see that the full screen experience is not available yet. So we want to go to the Vive Tool GitHub page linked in the description and we want to download this one here, Vive Tool Intel AMD.zip and extract it to your downloads folder and here we want to select inside our file path and we want to highlight all of it, right click and copy. Then we want to go to start, we want to go to search and we want to type CMD and we want to run a command prompt as administrator. Inside command prompt we need to type cd space and then press ctrl and v to paste our path and press enter and afterwards we need to type the following two commands that I've pasted in the description. So enter the first one and make sure the number's correct and then press enter. We want to press up on our keyboard, erase this number and replace it with the other one or you can just copy and paste the second command pressing enter and you'll see the success message again now we need to go to our start menu go to run and type regedit to bring up our registry editor now inside here we need to go into h key local machine software microsoft scroll down until you see Windows NT. Open this folder, choose current version, scroll down until you find OEM. And inside here, we want to right click, choose new, D word 32 bit value. And we're going to rename this to device form. And make sure it's a capital D and a capital F. Go inside device form and we're going to change our value to 2E. So make sure it's set as 2E and then press OK. Afterwards we're going to press start and then restart our device. Go back to the gaming tab and you'll see the full screen experience option has now appeared. And what we want to do is change choose home app to Xbox and then we want to toggle on enter full screen experience on startup. Go to game bar and make sure that both of these toggles are set on. After all of this is complete we want to press restart and when we load back into Windows you'll see the Xbox full screen experience. So I hope this helped you with getting the Xbox full screen experience set up on your Windows handheld and if you enjoyed and learned something new today Please give this video a like, subscribe to the channel, leave a comment and share this video with others. And let us know in the comments if you've discovered any new tips or tricks while using the Xbox full screen experience. Until next time, have a wonderful day, look out for one another and I'll see you later.